welcome to another edition of Arizona Living. One of our viewers requested a video specifically about grocery shopping here in Arizona. Stay tuned. So there's lots of places to go grocery shopping in Arizona. I'm in Target right now. Let me show you what it looks like. There you go, you got flowers, you got fruits, you got vegetables, it's just like you're anywhere else. Now we normally don't do our traditional grocery shopping at Target. One thing I wanted to point out, in Arizona, they sell alcohol everywhere. It's not like in Jersey where you have to have a special license. Everywhere, including like gas stations. So in Arizona, there's lots of places to go grocery shopping. There's a place we're about to go to called Fry's, not to be confused with Fry's Electronics. There's also Albertsons, and there's, uh, what's that other big one? Oh, Safeway. There's also Safeway. Bash. And, and Bashes. Bashes. Eddie Bash it. And then, they're, they're, you know, if you're looking for more like organic type stuff, like um, Whole Foods, we're talking Sprouts, we're talking uh, the Natural Grocer, Trader Joe's. Trader Joe's. Yeah, and there's of course Costco's and as you just saw Target and Walmart's um, one, one thing Winco Winco's kind of cool It's kind of like a Costco, but you don't require a membership and you don't have to buy in bulk But I don't like to go there because it's so big it takes forever to go food shopping So I prefer to go my personal favorite is Sprouts This particular fries we're gonna go to now is a little overcrowded um, Allegedly, they're gonna make one near my home, uh, but for now we go here. It's really crowded. I, I don't like going there. I prefer to pay a little bit extra and go to Sprouts. But anyway, I'm gonna show you what fries here looks like. Just keep in mind they're not all this crowded. I forgot to mention that some of the uh, supermarkets here actually have babysitting. How cool is that? So that's fries right there. The prices, unless you go to like a farmer's market for vegetables, you, you're not really get. Not gonna get that big of a deal. You got a Starbucks. They have this. I don't know how the heck that stuff works. Some scanner thing. So it's just like going to a wall bounds. I don't even know if those things exist anymore or like uh, AMP. It's the same type of deal. When are you gonna behave? Whenever we go grocery shopping, Roy and I always pick a drink to share and we open it and drink it during our shopping trip. Sarah doesn't like it when we do that, but we always pay. So we're gonna go check out Winco. So this is the place I was telling you guys that is the size of a Costco, but you don't need a membership and you don't need to buy in bulk. And they especially have a really nice produce center. As you can see, Winco has a huge selection of vegetables and fruits. My daughter saw this from across the room. She's like, get my pizza cat, pizza cat. I don't know, apparently this is a thing. Hey, Roar, here's pizza cat. Look at all the barrels they have in this stuff. And you could even uh, make your own peanut butter. There's like a peanut butter machine over here. Honey. And there's the uh, peanut butter I was talking about. Fresh peanut butter. And check out this coffee section. Unbelievable. And look, you grind it right there. Look at all these options. And look, just so you can get an idea how mammoth Winco is. He love more, mommy or daddy. Don't stick it down. Be a little more. Mommy or daddy. <laughs> Sarah informed me that this particular wine, 19 Crimes, there's an app. And I don't know what you do with the app, but it like talks to you. I guess you scan this. I don't know. But it sounds pretty cool. And it's cheap. It's only uh, 
$8.28. I really can't emphasize how big this place is. It's, it's humongous. Look at this, crawfish. And sushi. They even have Cajun dip. So the fancy products bring up a good point. There are no Wegmans here in Arizona that I'm aware of. However, we do have AJ's, which is a much smaller version. Rory's happy because she got a free sample. Check this out. They like have two aisles at checkout. So they got that thing that moves. So while these guys are bagging, I'll be bagging over there. So when I first moved to Arizona, I went to a place called Safeway and in Arizona, you don't bag yourself usually. Usually, you know, people that work there bag for you. So after they were done bagging my stuff, they asked me, would you like help bringing this to your car? And I looked at the person, I was like, do I look like I need help bringing this to my car? Turns out they asked that to everybody. So if you're concerned about there not being quote unquote normal places to go shopping in Arizona, you don't need to worry about that if you're in the Phoenix area. They have everything here. 